वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम वन पॉइंट फोर फोर थ्री सो स्टेटमेंट इज टू वुडन मेम्बर शोन विच सपोर्ट्स अ थ्री पॉइंट सिक्स किप्स लोड्स आर जॉइंट बाय प्लाई वुड स्प्लाइस ग्लूड ऑन द सर्फेस इन कंटेक्ट द अल्टीमेट शेयरिंग स्ट्रेस इन द ग्लू इज थ्री सिक्सटी पी एस आई एंड द क्लियरेंस बिटवीन द मेम्बर इज वन और फोर इंच डिटरमाइन द रिक्वायर्ड लेंथ ऑफ द ईच स्प्लाइस इफेक्टर ऑफ सेफ्टी ऑफ टू पॉइंट सेवन फाइव इज टू बी चीफ सो यू कैन सी दिस इज अ वुडन मेम्बर एंड दिस इज अ वुडन मेम्बर दैट आर जॉइंट बाय प्लाई वुड स्प्लाइस दिस इज द प्लाई वुड स्प्लाइस एंड द क्लियरेंस बिटवीन दिस टू वुडन इज वन ओवर फोर इंच दे आर ग्लूड टूगेदर ओके सो द अल्टीमेट शेयरिंग स्ट्रेस of in the glue is 360 psi and this clearance is 1 over 4 inch so you have to find this required length each of each splice if factor of safety of 2.75 is achieved so i have written all the given data and what is required is length l so let's start with the solution now you can see that this is the total length of the wooden splice and you can see from this length till this length let this length is small l there is then a small gap that is 1 over 4 inch and then there is another portion of the glue so two portion upper portion and two lower portion there are four separate areas of glues so there i will write there are four separate area of glue let each length let small l be the length of each and you can see the width is given as 5 inch and width is equal to 5 inch then each area then each area will be represented as a and that will be equal to length multiplied by this width i will explain it again you can see this portion will have glue this portion will have glue similarly lower portion and each portion so this width multiplied by this small l this is the small l will be one area similarly this width will and small area will be each uh, area and below to so total are four areas now each glue we will see that i will also explain so first i will write each each glue area glue area transmits one half of the one half of total load how so let's let discuss that you can see a load of 3.6 is applied so if i cut there this total load is carried by this portion plus this portion so this will be equal to 3.6 so half of this portion will take the load glued area will take the load of 3.6 divided by 2 so i will write so let if i draw the half portion clear and there is and this is the half portion so total load in this portion will be equal to 3.6 kips p now you can see this were joined together by glue so this half area or this area will take a load of f is equal to 1 over 2 multiply by 3.6 kips so it will be 1.8 kips it means that this half portion takes 1.5 kips load and this half takes 1.8 kips so total is 3.6 kips now uh we know that uh, this is the load taken by each so required i will write required ultimate 
load ultimate load is the maximum load for each glue area and that will be equal to force or road ultimate for each glue is equal to factor of safety multiplied by f because we know that factor of safety is equal to ultimate load divided by the applied load or actual load so from this formula i will get f u ultimate is equal to factor of safety multiplied by f so factor of safety is 2.75 and f is 1.8 so when you multiply it you will get ultimate load on each glue is comes out to be 4.95 that means that maximum 4.7 4.95 can uh, force can be applied on each glue area now we know that sharing ultimate sharing strength stress that is given as 360 psi so ultimate sharing stress is equal to ultimate force divided by the area of the each uh, section or glue area so from here you will get um, f ultimates come out to be sharing ultimate into area okay so this area is equal to length multiplied by width that is shown over here clear okay so what we have to do is we have to put the uh, values and we do not know this l we have w we have this and we have this so l will be equal to f ultimate divided by tau ultimate into w so you have put the value 4.95 into 10 to power 3 divided by tau is 360 psi and w was 5 inch so from here you will get 2.75 inch so this small l is equal to 2.75 inch now you can check that here this uh, here i have already mentioned this is small l this is small l then there is a small gap of one four that is equal to capital l or this capital l is equal to l plus l plus one by four so i will write that this capital l is equal to small l plus small l plus one over four inch so small l is 2.5 plus 2.5 uh not 2.5 2.75 that is given over here 2.75 2.75 plus 1 over 4 is 0 0.25 so you will get total length of each splice comes out to be 5.75 inch so it means that this length should be equal to 5.75 inch in order to support this load and ultimate strength uh, sharing strength of the glue is 360 psi uh, i hope you have enjoyed this problem and if you are new to my channel then subscribe it and keep watching thank you